Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do Kane's, <laughs> he looks a little scared. Um, I'm gonna do Kane's six month update. He is six months old as of the 8th of May. So I'm a little bit late. He's looking at all the birds that are flying right above behind us. Anywho, um, so we'll start with his schedule. He gets up about 7, 7.30 on a good day. Lately it's been kind of like five, but that's okay. Um, and he'll have a bottle. He'll go down for his first nap at 10. He has a bottle every three to four hours, six ounces. And then he um, takes a nap at 10. And he takes another nap at 1.30. And he takes his last nap at 5 to 5.30. His naps range from like 30 minutes to an hour. And then he goes to bed at night at 7.30 and sleeps the majority of the night. Um, sometimes he'll wake up randomly at 1.00 but I don't go in there because it only makes it worse and he doesn't go back to sleep. Um, but he will wake up usually between five and seven um, for the day. As for his eating, he just started solid foods. He likes um, bananas, he likes avocado, and he likes um, the little mum mum bananas. We just started that yesterday. I'm still a little nervous because he chokes really easily. Um, which I think is just new, the whole situation. Um, but he is also having pureed food. He's just not a fan of pureed, just like Milua. She always gagged and made the craziest faces on pure. Um, but he eats about once a day, sometimes, um, with the pure, and then the mum mum snack during the day as well. As for his new skills, he can... Um, army crawl, he can crawl, he's only crawled two times hands and knees wise, but he's very mobile and very much wants to, I don't know what he sees out there, um, wants to be involved in everything Mila had. He needed a bottle, so he's right there holding his bottle. Um, but as for his new skills, he is army crawling, um, he has crawled hands and knees, he just is a lot faster army crawling, so he prefers just to army crawl. And his, he crawls so incredibly fast, as fast as he can to get to anything that Mila has. Um, he can now hold his bottle. He can sit up, but he sits up like, like that, like <laughs> on his side. He doesn't like sit up normally this way. So I was trying um, like a different, we have like a little car that he could sit in um, to help with him sitting straight up and down. But I remember with Mila, she didn't sit up until like, seven months I feel like stably like seven months um so he's got time um he is also he's also teething he has two teeth already on the bottom I think I see another one coming in on this side I don't see any top teeth but he's chewing on his hands so 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 much and I only have the teething rings like the frozen ones um, and he likes them and then he doesn't like them. Like he's like done as soon as they're not frozen anymore. Um, I also wanted to try the teething stick. So if you've tried that, let me know. I want to try it, but I'm really skeptical of such a large stick and chewing on it. But I feel like he likes to chew on things. So that might be something that he would like, but I haven't tried it yet. I have not been to the doctor yet for his six month appointment. They actually dropped him from our insurance. So that's something that we're dealing with right now, which is just a huge, huge mess. He was supposed to have his appointment on Monday, but he obviously didn't. Um, I would assume he weighs about 14 pounds. He's pretty heavy. I'm debating on switching him out of the infant seat into the forever car seat that we have for Mila because carrying him in a carrier is intense. It's very heavy. Um, as for clothing, he's in six month clothing. He could still wear three to six month pants or shorts. Um, but as for everything else, he's in six month clothing. Some of the new toys we have bought for him have been the walker. So we just bought him a walker and he does pretty well in it. He does a little bit better than Mila does if I, or did if I remember correctly. Um, and it's somewhere I could put him that he doesn't cry because he, lately he's been like, hold me, hold me, hold me. And I already have a hurt wrist 
And so it's been a little bit of a struggle there. But lately he's been good in the walker and he's been good on the floor. We just got our carpets clean. So it's like a double plus that he could be down there. He's loving bath time. I bathe them together. And so they play together. And like the last time they took a bath together, because the last few nights I haven't bathing them, haven't been bathing them together. They played together for like 30 minutes and it was so, so fun to watch. But he loves the water as long as it's warm. Cold water, he does not do well in. <laughs> like the pool, he does not do well in. He likes it for a second and then once it like touches his belly, he's like, get me out of this pool right now as fast as you can. <laughs> All right, I think that is it for his six month update. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I will see you for my next video. Bye.